Hello guys, welcome back to part two of the uh, Palmer to Gatwick uh, in the FSLab 319 Easy 5 7 at Charlie Zulu. Uh, we're currently just under 20 miles away from top of descent, so we're just going to already program the arrival, which is when, when we left Timber 4 Bravo. ILS 26 was, has not changed. Uh, we're just going to enter the approach page stuff. So the q and check at Gatwick is currently 1008. Temperature is 9 degrees. The wind is currently uh, 210 at 13. Uh, transition level is 60. And the minimums is 396. Entered, and we're going to be landing config 3, as Gatwick has a long enough runway to do so. So we need to click uh, landing flap 3 up there. Should pop up on the ECAM. There, still no air traffic control online. That is a random day today, Wednesday. On that sim, so I doubt we have any ATC for arrival. Although ground or something might pop on, but um, I'm going to be highly doubtful of that. So yeah, about just under 10 miles to go now. Uh, we're going to initially descend flight level 160 because we have a restriction at yeah we have a restriction of 16 at. And at flight level one six, then we have a restriction of six five four, and then two. It's pretty straightforward. But yeah, let's. Uh, I might as well start it now. Just might as well start it now, and it'll catch up with itself in a minute. So while we're in the descent we might as well do a quick brief. So we are on the Timber 4 Bravo arrival. Uh, landing ILS runway 26 left, not expecting to hold. Straight in, um, if we need to miss approach, we're going to climb to 3000 feet, straight ahead until passing 2000 or one dear me from India Whiskey whis India Whiskey Whiskey inbound, whichever is later. Then a left into a heading of 179, then as directed. In our case, as we have no ATC, we will probably just go. Uh, where shall we go? We'll go back to Will we'll go to Willow and hold if necessary, or we'll go to Willow and then we'll shoot the approach again. So remember, we need to put, we need to put in three thousand. Minimums are set. Um, we are below lack. Let me just double check. We should be anyway. Uh, Six one one. We are definitely below max landing weight. Um, wind is twelve knots. So no concern now. We are manual landing. And uh, that should be about it for the brief. Nothing unusual. No weather concerning us. Nothing. Should be pretty straightforward. Uh, auto brake is set to low. Flaps 3 is already checked. Double check in the FN and uh, CDU config. Three is set. Passing flight level 109. 44. We'll say I forgot I can do this on departure, but we can do the PA announcement, can't we? So I uh, get my other mic down. Hang on. Kamuku, 10 minutes to landing. 10 minutes to landing. 
Time to go, 10 minutes to London, 10 minutes to London. <laughs> down to 4,000 Here comes the clouds as soon as we get in them, we stick the anti-ice on just in case. Bear cloud surfing. Can't see any traffic around us. Nobody's posted on that. So I'll post when I'm on finals just in case someone is going to line up. As soon as we're going to go below transition, we all stick in the, the Q&H. Oh, 1003? 1003? That is 1003, I can't read. Uh, 1003, my bad. Not 8, that's a 3. 1003, set. Uh, perf. 1003. One zero zero three one zero zero three sack. Right, we'll stick anti ice on. What's the outside air temperature? Uh, 8 degrees, not too bad. And it's raining, great, but on my display it's not raining, great. Oh, it says say showers, it's not raining on my weather radar, look at that. That looks sick. Oh, there is snow on the ground. There is not snow on the ground at the UK at the moment, but uh, just because of Orbex winter uh, time, there is snow on the ground. So 2,000 we can set. we are below the glide slope.
2500. And we can take anti ice off. Lot star. Okay, approach mode is active. Two thousand. There's a little bit of weather there. So we can do uh, approach checklist, briefing is confirmed, ECAM status is checked, seatbelt signs are on, barrel records are set, MDA decision height is set, engine mode selected is normal, approach checklist is complete, flaps 1. Just announce them on finals. Flaps two. Get down. Get some lights. Oh, it's not going to follow that now, is it? I'll do it myself. That's three. That's my bad. One thousand checked. Uh, landing checklist. Camera crew is advised. Auto throttle is. Well, I'm going to leave it on. And um, ECAM no landing, no blue. Landing checklist is complete. 500.
200. Minimum. Continue. 100. 50. 40. 30. 20. Retard. 10. 5. I don't know that's... And ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Gatwick. But the local time is just coming up to half past two. Right, let me get the ground chart quickly. What stand did we say we're going on? 109. Right, let's do uh, TCAS. Boilers, weather radar, uh, lights. We'll put Kate onto Juliet, and we're going to start the clock for three minutes, so we can do a single engine taxi. Actually, no, we won't. We won't single engine taxi. There is no point. Whoa, rip FPS. And welcome to a rainy Gatwick. I really need to get used to the tiller on this. Flaps up. I did the lights tonight. Uh, APU start for light director. Now that's that side, and we are going to stand gate. One oh nine. No, follow me. Easy jet. It would be DHL, but should be DHL as DHL handle one, but easy jet, it's fine. That is cool. That is a cool rain effects. Rain effects now. I must say, but I'm not keeping the wiper on because that is annoying as hell. Why does it keep going to the left? The right, I mean, sorry. Stop taking me to the right. The taxi light on. Yes. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that flight today. It makes a change from going to a uh, cold destination as we are in the winter schedule, but I uh, will be doing some winter flights in the next couple of weeks, so expect videos on them. As I said in the video before, I'm going to be starting my Twitch channel up again, so you might see me go live. I'll leave a link in the description to my Twitch channel. Uh, as I said already, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment down below if you've got any flight requests you want me to do, settings you want to know, and I can provide all of that for you in the comments. Do we need 
to take a left on Quebec and then on to Kilo. This is miserable. Such a miserable day. It's not raining outside my window, but then again, I am in Bristol. So it's the second left. There is someone on finals there. Right on to Kilo. Taxi light on. APU is available. Let's give the wipers a wipe. There's 110. And here is 109. Hello EasyJet in the terminal there. My wing's gonna smash straight into those set of steps, are they? No, oh, just, oh no, we did it. Whoa, lag, lag, lag. That'll do. Cookie's telling me to stop. Parking brake is on. APU bleed. Engine number one, engine number two. And the parking checklist. APU bleed is on. Engines are off. Seatbelt sign can come off. Exterior lights off. Fuel pumps off. Parking brake is set. That's the parking checklist complete. Well, guys, welcome to a shower of shit. Gatwick. Excuse my French. Get the jetway and get the boarding. Yeah, one five five. Yeah, welcome to Gatwick. Not a bad landing, not bad. Uh, what was. Uh, I'll link the Project Fly in the. Um, uh, the Project Fly link in the description below so you can check that out if you want. Um, yeah, more videos are going to be on the way. There's a lamp poster. Yeah, more videos on the way. Going to be doing some winter schedules. And uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes for 2019. Welcome to 2019. Hope you had a good 2018 and uh, uh, yeah, hope to see you in the next video. Uh, peace. Peace out. See ya.